August 10, 1874, West Branch, Iowa. Herbert Hoover takes his first breath in a modest two-room cottage. Welcomed by older brother Theodore, he would later be joined by a sister, Mary. The stirrings of industrial America were present in the heat and clanging steel of the blacksmith forge owned by his father, Jesse. A progressive businessman who later owned a farm implement store, Jesse embodied the entrepreneurial spirit that was awakening in America and thrummed in the rapidly growing town. Herbert Hoover's later achievements reflected his father's ambition and commitment to serving others. His mother, Hulda, who had taken college preparation classes and taught school, nurtured his intellectual curiosity. A devout Quaker, her leadership as a recorded minister made her a role model of someone who worked toward the greater good. At two years old, a serious bout of croup nearly ended Herbert's life. In fact, his parents thought he was dead, until his uncle, Dr. John Minthorne, resuscitated him at the last moment. Thanks in part to the encouragement of William Walker, a local dentist, he pursued the study of geology, eventually traveling the globe in search of the Earth's riches and becoming a world-renowned mining engineer. The stage was set for Herbert to achieve great things, but to truly understand the forces and values that shaped him, one must look to the people who settled West Branch.